In this video, we'll find the percent composition by mass of each element here in AgNO3. This is silver nitrate. So we have this equation here to help us. And the first thing we need to do is figure out the molar mass of the entire compound. This is this AgNO3. We want to know the molar mass for AgNO3. That'll look like this. So we have 169.88 grams per mole for the molar mass for the AgNO3. Let's find the percent composition by mass for each element here in silver nitrate. Let's start with the silver, Ag, and we have the mass of the element. So silver is 107.87 grams per mole. We get that from the periodic table. Since there's only one silver, we would multiply by one, so we don't need to do anything. And then we divide that by the molar mass of the compound, which we just found. We'll multiply by 100 to get a percent, Grams per mole cancels out, it's on the top and the bottom. We end up with the percent composition for the silver and silver nitrate, 63.50%. That means if we had a sample of silver nitrate, the mass of the silver would make up 63.50% of the mass of the compound. Let's do the nitrogen. Nitrogen is 14.01 grams per mole. I won't write the units since they cancel out. We only have one nitrogen, so the number of element, that's one. Divide by our molar mass for the compound, multiply by 100, and we end up with 8.25% for the nitrogen in AgNO3. Let's do the oxygen. So for the oxygen, we have 16.00, that's the molar mass of oxygen. We have three oxygen atoms, so the number of that element, the number of the oxygen, that's three, divide again by the molar mass of the compound, multiply by 100, and we get 28.26%. And these numbers should add up to close to 100, very close to 100%. They might be a little bit off my periodic table rounds to two decimal points. This is Dr. B with the percent composition by mass for each element here in AgNO3, silver nitrate. Thanks for watching.